Luke chapter 12, starting at verse 16. Then he told them a parable, saying, There was a rich man whose land was very fertile and productive. And when he began thinking to himself, What should I do, since I have no place large enough in which to store my crops? Then he said, This is what I will do. I will tear down my storehouses and build larger ones, and I will store all my grain and my goods there. And I will say to my soul, Soul, you have many good things stored up, enough for many years. Rest and relax, eat, drink, and be merry. Celebrate continually. But God said to him, You fool! This very night your soul is required of you, and now who will own all the things you have prepared? So it is for the one who continues to store up and hoard possessions for himself and is not rich in his relationship toward God. Jesus said to his disciples, For this reason I tell you, do not worry about your life as to what you will eat or about your body as to what you will wear. For life is more than food, and the body more than clothes. Consider the ravens, for they neither sow seed nor reap the crop. They have no storehouse or barn, and yet God feeds them. How much more valuable are you than the birds? And which of you, by worrying, can add one hour to his lifespan? So if you are not even able to do a very little thing such as that, why are you worried about the rest? Consider the lilies and wildflowers, how they grow in the open field. They neither labor nor spin wool to make clothing. Yet I tell you, not even Solomon in all his glory and splendor dressed himself like one of these. But if this is how God clothes the grass, which is in the field today and tomorrow is thrown into the furnace, how much more will he clothe you? You of little faith. So as for you, do not seek what you will eat and what you will drink, nor have an anxious or an unsettled mind. For all the pagan nations of the world greedily seek these things, and your heavenly Father already knows that you need them. But strive for and actively seek His kingdom, and these things will be given to you as well. Do not be afraid and anxious, little flock, for it is your Father's good pleasure to give you the kingdom. Sell your possessions, show compassion, and give donations to the poor. Provide money belts for yourselves that do not wear out, an unfailing and inexhaustible treasure in the heavens where no thief comes near and no moth destroys. For where your treasure is, there your heart will be also. Thank you.